and the kids. Y'all, I just woke up. I woke up early. My sleep has been like crazy though. But I woke up earlier than what I usually do. Oh, hold on y'all for I woke up earlier than what I usually do. So I was able to get the kids ready. I didn't have to rush. And baby, it felt so much better. Like everybody was cooperating everything. Y'all, we got out the house. Now, and I'm literally pulling up to Elias School and it still got five minutes to open. So, that's how our morning going, y'all. Huh? So, yeah, y'all. I'm about to take him into his school. I'm hungry. Y'all. All weekend, y'all, cheating on Keto. I don't regret it, though. I needed that. Y'all, I ate Chipotle twice. Y'all know I'm addicted. I ate Chipotle twice, and I had cookout. Y'all, it was so good. My bowls was made with so much love. Where should I park it? My eye been switching. Oh, Lord. But yes, y'all. Oh, I hope the radio wasn't in there. I'll see y'all when I get home. Though. Oh, that's what I was talking about. Cheating on keto. We back on it today. I'm already hungry. Let me take Elias in this school. All right, y'all. So, Elias. It's dropped off in his class. It's just, y'all, it's just, it's like, it's a happy sad, but it makes me so sad just knowing how fast my kids are growing up. And it's just crazy because, okay, because now you about to get hit in that bluebird. What the heck? But anyways, it's just crazy, like, just to see them grow. And it's like, I spend every day with them every single day and it's like i look at a picture from 2022 and they just so small like when did y'all get big it's just it's crazy it's crazy like mari she she's reading reading she's reading i spelled something out right i was sitting there talking on the phone y'all know kids i'll be all in your conversation I sat there and I spelled something out. She talked about something. Mommy, did you just spell like? It's crazy. My baby gonna be seven years old. I remember when she was seven days old. Like, and don't get me on Elias. Cause, oh, that's, that's, that's my youngest. That's my baby boy. About to be three. I remember sitting there having him barely made it to the dang hospital. I sound like a frog. Y'all, it's just these kids is getting older and I just, I want to make sure, you know, they have a great life. Like, I don't want them to want for nothing. So, baby, I'm on my grind. Because them kids, those two, they good forever. Don't matter who around and who ain't. They good. So, I feel very motivated today. Um, What's on the agenda? Like I said, I'm back on keto. Um, Like I said, I'm very, feeling very motivated today. This weekend, because I didn't vlog at all, y'all. But this weekend, I... We really ain't do nothing. We just was chilling in the house. Friday and Saturday night, I had my friends over, so that was fun. Um, Sunday, I just, we just laid around. So, like I said, I feel very motivated today. I am going to take this day and do some cleaning. Um just straightening up from the weekend and stuff like that i want to give you guys an updated um house tour video 
because I know a lot of y'all found me from the moving vlog. So I want to give y'all an update because I wasn't going to do an update. I was going to wait until like my whole house was together. But it takes months for a house to get together. Like I want to decorate and all of this stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and show y'all how it's looking now. What we living in now. And then I'm going to just do like parts. Because, like, the kids' room, their rooms are done right now. But it's like I still want to decorate their room, character rooms. Um, like Elias, I want him to have a whole dinosaur room. Mari, she want Ella Will doll room. So, like, stuff like that, I'm just going to do separate videos for. Like, separate parts, like part two or whatever, part three. Um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Because, like, my bedroom, I my bedroom... Baby, I don't even sleep in there because I don't have a mattress. I need to get me a mattress and then my um my bed said it was broke at the last place because Elias he was like nine months un he loves to unscrew things. He had unscrewed a bolt and the whole thing like just fell. So, but I think it's fixable. That's why I kept it. Oh, hold on, I'm driving y'all. Yeah, I think it's fixable. That's why I kept it. But also, um, I need to get a whole new mattress and box spring. I didn't want to bring a dirty mattress with me. It's dirty for my kids and stuff like that. So, I need to get a new mattress, box spring, a whole bunch of stuff. The air mattress I was on, baby, I was tired of sleeping on that. So, I tossed that. It had a slow leak. I tossed that. So, baby... Yeah, I say all of that to say like my house is not done at all, but it's livable and I want to show y'all like how it is so far. And then like within the next few months, I'm going to really start um, getting it together. It's just moving is so overwhelming all together. The packing, the unpacking, it's just, it's, it's, it's stressful. But yeah, I love being, I love my house. So I'm going to just show y'all how it is so far so i'm gonna go ahead and clean up so i can do that video for y'all i just and then i got so many loads of clothes that i need to fold i've just been washing them and haven't folded a thing so that's what i got planned for when i get back home so i'll see y'all there all right y'all so i'm about to do tiffany hair she then came and pulled up so i'm about to do her hair she getting um what is called mini twist so that's what we about to do hopefully we got enough hair i feel like we do yeah so that's what we about to do Well, I'll never not ever have my at least one toe in the street. <laughs> How y'all like Tiffany hair? That was my first time doing that, y'all. But yeah, so when I got done with that, I heard up, hopped in the car, came and got Elias. I still had more time, but last on Friday, his teacher told me that when he's the last one in the classroom, he starts to get up. Oh, hold on. He starts to get whiny, so I'm gonna make sure he's not the last one. Cause all last week I was, I ain't come get him. You gotta pick them up by 2:30, baby. It was 2:25 all last week. I was not going to get him to like 2:25. So I'm behind this Amazon truck, and I don't know where they're going. But yeah, so I came and got him. It's like 2:10 now. He wasn't the last one. It was still three more kids. So, yep, came and got him. And now I'm about to go get in the line to go get Mari. This Amazon truck does not know where they're going. But, yeah, so that's what we got going on. He back there eating his chips. I always need a snack in the car. But, yeah, 
so I see y'all when I get Mari. It's raining. I need to go to like Dollar General Family Dollar or something because we need some tissue. But it's raining real bad. All right, I'll see y'all when we get the Mari Mari. All right, y'all. So we home. Say hey, Mari. Hi. Uh -oh. About to do her homework, so. Hiya! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm joking. Just cut you off. Hi, guys, I got a loose tooth, and I'm doing my homework, and yeah. And my mommy is doing my homework for me. Oh, look. <laughs> okay, so what's this one? Always have to right, so it says cut the addition equations and glue them on the snowman circle that has the matching sum. So yeah, cut out your circle. Um, and then, for example, what is three plus one equal? Um, one, two, three, four. All right, so you would glue that up under number four. You got those instructions? Yes. Okay. And y'all dogs are going to stay in here with me. Well, Mommy, you can go lay down in my bed. <laughs> Why do you want me to lay down? Because I'm making a little surprise for you. So, see you later, alligator. The dog is going to stay in here with me. Well, just to show you some arms for you. And the lock. <laughs> Look, lock. Say little kitty. The kitty. 3 plus 1 equals 4. So, yeah. 3 plus 1 equals 4 in the lock. So, I will glue it. Look at this glue lock. Why? No man. Bobby. My room is Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's just start with the first one, but never mind. Okay, these ones are easy because I already know them. So I don't have to use my fingers. Then with the first cutting glue. Y'all, I'm over here putting clothes in her drawer. Peep her bed. It's a little sneak peek. <laughs> okay, seven, nine. You're nine. not allowed to see our bed. My bed. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're do one and, more. and there you go. That's all the peaks. <laughs> oh, you only got. You only. Let me see. One. You got three more. And you got four more. Okay, do this one too. Okay, we're only doing two. Yeah. Oh, buddy, you can do this one. <clears throat> okay, let me start. Okay, so this one, you have to cut and glue the numbers in order by counting by fives to 50. So she got to cut out the snowballs and put them. In order from five to fifty. Yep. Yes, 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 yep, yep, yep. Yuppity, yup, and yuppity, yup. Here. So small to big. So five. What's after five? Is forty a small number out of all of these? Yes. Don't guess. I'm asking. Mm, yes. So it's five forty 
20. No, you're missing one. Um, Look at all your numbers. 10, 14. 5, 15, and then 10? No, 10. All right. And then what's next? 15. And then what's next? 20. Mm-hmm. And then 25. And then 30. 40. I and think you missed one. Yeah. Check your work. Okay, now say them out loud. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. Good job. Go ahead, glue them things down. You say you don't know how to count by five. What you just hit your food? No, hit me, no. Whoa, whoa, you okay? Mm -hmm. Let me see. Pick up trash, mommy. All right, y'all. She done with her homework. They give a packet. Hold on, because y'all probably can't hear. They give a packet for the whole week. So today, Tuesday, it's it be like five to ten sheets in there. So we do about one to two a day instead of waiting until like Thursday trying to jam pack it. Yes, you can. But now I'm about to go ahead and take a shower, y'all, because. You don't want it? Or are you trying to show them you got chocolate? You got backup, son. Yeah, so I'm about to go ahead and take a shower because it's giving. I'm about to just chill with the kids, fold these clothes up. So I just want to go ahead and take a shower. Plus, I was doing hair and all of that. So I'll see y'all when I get out. What just happened? Yeah, too. Okay, don't drop it. Her tooth fell out, y'all, when I was in the shower. I'm, I'm thinking something wrong. So she about to rinse her mouth out now. So, y'all, I'm in Mari's room. Chilling with them. As, I don't know if y'all can hear me because I was in the shower. That girl lost her tooth. How you feel, Mari? Girl, you barely... It was only a brief second she had two teeth because the other one came out when she was three. And then that one started growing in, and now the one beside it came out. Oh, 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 I like you never gonna have two front teeth. Y'all, so that two fairy coming tonight, Mari? Uh -huh. What? It's coming tonight. <laughs> it's two fairies I'm coming. I'm most excited about mine. Two. Hold on, I don't want to get copyright. All right, y'all. Mari wants me to open up this Barbie she got for Christmas. Um, Auntie People's house. Yeah, she got it for Christmas. Oh, uh, but I just didn't get it. Yeah. So, yeah, we're about to open this. No, you're not about to play with my toys. You already lost something. All right, y'all. So, he seen me opening Mari's stuff, so he want me to build this racetrack, Hot Wheels track. I don't let my kids open all the stuff on Christmas because they open it and forget about it. Versus, it's like a new toy each week. So, we get to the end. Open it. I'm opening it. Mommy got to build it. Hold on. Leave the pieces. Leave the pieces. Mommy have to build it. Leave them. Mommy has to build it. What mommy just say? Put it down. What mommy just say? Put it down. Put it down. Put it down. Okay, this one looks too hard. 
I'll show y'all when it's I'll show y'all it when it's built. Can you run it up? Put in another load of clothes. I'm about to go ahead and wash up. Oh, I got heartburn. I'm about to wash up the rest of these dishes. I had washed them earlier, but this is the second half. And then I'm about to also go ahead and get dinner started. Mm. So one of the main reasons why I ended up cheating on keto was because I did not feel like cooking that day, y'all. And for days like that, before when I was on keto and I didn't feel like cooking, I would just pop something in the air fryer or I would meal prep and I forgot. So I'm about to meal prep a few meals for those days that I don't want to cook. So one of the things is salads. I seen this on TikTok. They go ahead and make the whole salad in the mason jar and then they just dump it and it be on their plate. So, I think I had showed y'all last week when I was separating the meat. Anyways, I got two good old juicy chicken breasts. They already seasoned up and cleaned and everything. I'm about to cook that on a griddle. I want to make at least two salads and then um, I want to make a quesadilla tonight chicken quesadilla with the low carb things and I want to do like the fajita vegetables and then for the kids for the kids and also my meal prep I'm going to just make some chicken legs they already seasoned up and everything I'm about to go ahead and pop those in the oven actually yeah 
I'm going to pop those in the oven and then I'm going to go ahead and um, cut up my chicken and my vegetables. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to do. So, I'll show y'all. Let me wipe this counter off first because this looks crazy. So, I got my pan. And this is why I like just seasoning. Washing it and seasoning it. Seasoning it beforehand because literally... I just dump it right in this, uh, right in the pan. Straightening it up. And jump it up on the top of each other. Two, four. Six, eight, ten. Ten pieces of chicken, so that's enough for us to eat and for me to do a few meals. With that, I'm about to put some butter in the um, pan so it don't stick, and I'm going to pop it in the oven. And then I'm going to cut my vegetables for my salad. Quesadilla, cucumber. I forgot a tomato, but I got cucumber, green, pepper, and onion. So, yeah. Cut up my vegetables. On one of my videos... Someone commented and said, if you put something under the little cutting board, it won't be sliding. But I can't remember what they said to put it. I'm going to put a paper towel. What did they say put? And what, do I just like smack it under? Oh, I think this might work. Um, okay, let me wash my vegetables. Cut the cucumber first. Now, I love cucumbers, y'all, but I don't really get them from restaurants because they cut them so thick. I like them real thin. And I think I'm going to actually dice these up. Like I said, I'm only trying to make enough for two to three salads because I'm not a big salad eater. Oh, look, the cutting board is not moving, y'all. So, the paper towel works. My kid is yelling, but this, this, this is what it is. They love each other, but they fight so much. Okay, I think this is enough cucumber. Green pepper. I'm not putting this in the salad. This is for my fajitas. I don't like no green pepper in no salad. The nobody's gonna make you change what you probably don't like anyway, but you done it. So you might as well.
And I got a taco seasoning that I'ma just put on, of course, the the ones that's going in the uh in the uh quesadilla. But the one for the chicken breast, like I don't I don't um need to season it anymore. So just gonna lay that on the griddle. Y'all think that's enough for two salads? Okay, that's all I'm putting. And then also in my salad, meat-wise, I'm gonna put some bacon. So I'm gonna cook um, two to three strips. And I'll be back when all of this is done and it's time for me to start the salad. Because y'all know how to cook the meat down. Okay, last but not least, this is my chicken for my quesadillas and I'm going to turn my griddle off for now but I am going to do my quesadilla on here but I'm going to do that when it's closer to the kids school being done too so. but this is my chicken looks good so now we're about to go ahead and make the salads I already cleaned out both jars oh it still got a little water I already rinsed them out Okay, now for my salads, I got both mason jars. I got my spinach, I'm about to rinse it off. Okay, so I rinse it off in the bag. You're probably not supposed to do that. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I got my cheese. Um, so how it is, you wanna, when you flip it up, you want it to be like made how you eat it. So lettuce, so wait. Okay, the chicken go first, the lettuce at the top. I'm about to just go ahead and put it. Next, this is bacon. Okay. Next, I'm gonna put a few sauteed veggies. Next, it's gonna be some cucumber. Oh, 
Oh, I wish I had a tomato, y'all. And next is going to be some shredded cheese. So this is how it's looking so far. Last but not least, I'm gonna fill the rest up with spinach. So it kind of worked out. I thought my jars was too big because a lot of people using the Dollar Tree jars, but it seemed like they have this much uh, lettuce or spinach. So I'm gonna pack that in there. Pack it in there. And I eat the stems too, so. I'm gonna keep packing it in there. That should be good. So this is one. Boom. So let me check. So that's my salad jars. I'm about to go ahead and put them in the fridge. It is so cute. So I'm about to go ahead and put them in the fridge and then um, just wait on this chicken to get done cooking. I'm gonna make them yellow rice. Let me go ahead and put it on because this rice takes so long to cook. So I'm gonna go ahead and put them some yellow rice on. Cause I feel like they had barbecue chicken and pasta a few days ago. So yeah, I'm gonna put this yellow rice on for them. And then I'm about to clean up this mess from this salad. And y'all know how to make a quesadilla. All I'm doing is putting the chicken and fajita vegetables in their cheese. So I really come back and show y'all when our food is done. I really just wanted to show y'all me meal prepping. So all right, y'all, this is the kids plate. Yeah, something simple, but hey, it's a home cooked meal. Um, I'm not about to, I don't, I'm not even hungry no more, so I'm not cooking that quesadilla. I'll probably make it tomorrow, and then I'm gonna come back and meal prep tonight. I'll show y'all because my stomach is like upset, and I don't know what's going on, but baby, I'm about to feed these kids, get them in the bed, and I come meal prep tonight. But yeah, this is a place simple i know y'all probably thinking what well, they always eat corn this the only vegetable they eat y'all so i still give it to them and i just said i'm about to start sneaking like spinach and stuff different green vegetables and i'm gonna start making them some smoothies so they can still have them green vegetables but corn is the only vegetable they eat on a plate so yeah but let me feed them y'all hey y'all good morning say hey Hey, you didn't do much of work. Good morning. Mm. We're not at school because mommy home. Mommy's stomach hurt. Mm. Mommy hurt. Mm -hmm. Y'all, I think I came on here and told y'all last night my stomach was hurting. Like, it felt so bad. I had to just go to sleep. And this morning, I kept waking up using the bathroom, and I felt, like, so nauseous. Y'all, I end up oversleeping, and the kids are here. Yeah. I need to clean this. This is from when I did Tiffany here yesterday. But, yeah, so they're chilling out today. I still could have took Mari to school, but we chilling. But mommy overslept. I did, but I didn't. It's like I woke up and I said, oh, I'm going to have to rush to get these kids together. No, you just had a juice box. I said, I'm going to have to rush to get the kids together. Y'all roll back over. Because my stomach is still like hurts. I don't know. I don't know, but. Oh. I'm about to get up and get them some cereal. I didn't even do my meal prep. I said I was going to do last night. So I guess I'll do it now. Clean up. 
Yeah, so. Blue raspberry. Oh, that girl can read. <laughs> you were out my glasses sometimes. No, Boop. Boop. Yeah, so I'll come back and show y'all what I do next, which I think is about to clean this kitchen meal prep. What's that? What meal prep? Where I get my meals together. I need help. I need help. I Put them in the help. refrigerator. All right, y'all, so I feel better now. Um, I just washed this shit. Let me show y'all. I just washed all of them. I'm going to clean up that back there, but I guess it's a mini update. If y'all remember, this whole thing was packed. It's just stuff that needs to go places now. But I washed the dishes. One thing, I do not like washing dishes, y'all. Like, that's one chore. If I didn't have to do it, I wouldn't do it. Um, So... I was gonna like vlog me washing dishes, but I just don't want to do it. So I have to literally watch a YouTube video while I do it. So 20 minutes and I did that. And I still got this stuff left right here, but I'm out of room. So when that dry, I'm gonna put that up and wash those pans, pots and pans. But I'm about to make my quesadilla right now cause I'm hungry. Cause I didn't eat last night cause my stomach was hurting so bad. So I had just put my stuff in the microwave. I need one more so. I might as well warm the chicken up too. Yeah, so I didn't. I didn't eat yesterday, and I'm hungry. It's 12 something. The kids, they had cereal. I don't know if I told you that. They had cereal. So, I know Mari like quesadillas. Elias, I don't think he does. But I didn't plan out no meals for them because I didn't expect them to be home. And I just didn't know how I was feeling. Like I could have forced myself to go take them to school, but what if I wasn't feeling good when it's time to pick them up? So I didn't know. I mean, yeah, I didn't take them. But they're going tomorrow, baby. I don't, still don't know what was wrong with me. I don't know. I'm thinking maybe because I haven't been eating keto and I just started that. But your girl was toe up. Toe up, honey. I put a lot of peppers and onions in my, uh, in my salad. And I could have ate that too, but like I told y'all, I gotta be in the mood for salads and I'm not in the mood, baby. I need something full filling. But my kids said is about to be good though. And then oh I still need the meal prep. Cause that chicken is just in the oven. Oh, Elias could eat one of those chicken legs. Yeah. That's exactly what he's gonna do. Let me see if Mari wants a quesadilla. So she not hungry. So, watch out, it's wet right there. Y'all, but I really can't wait to get the rest of this house together. Moving has just been like. Stop running, it's wet. Uh-uh, stop running, you're gonna fall. Moving has just been like overwhelming. And baby, I just had to take a break. But I've done a lot. Like literally, it's a box of shoes, Christmas decorations, and a box of books. That's really it. The box of books, I have to get a bookshelf for the kids. Well, I have Mari in her old room. She had like three shelves, three little floating shelves, and it had books on there. Um, but they're all different colors, so I want to spray paint that to match her room. She just told me today she want an all pink room. She want the walls paint all of that. Like, girl. But maybe I'll do a little wallpaper accent wall. 
Because, baby, when it's time to move, I, I for sure don't want to cover up no paint. But I do want to put, like, pictures on the walls and just decorate it, like, all together. So, yes. Cheers to getting my house together. My quesadilla is looking good. Let me show y'all. I just like to make sure my cheese is melted all the way through. And it looks like it is. But I'm about to eat this and then um, I'll probably come back in here and just sweep, mop, finish washing those dishes. I just do not like cleaning the kitchen, y'all. Which results into me not liking a cook because you need a clean kitchen to cook. In. And then after you get done cooking, you have to clean again. So, hot sauce. Say hey to my vlog. Hey. Say hey. hey. Do you love your mommy? Aunt. Mama, eat. You want banana? Banana. You gonna eat it? Cause you didn't eat it the other day. No. And this, you don't want banana? I want cookies. You want cookies? I guess I give you some cause eat. they're right here. Eat. 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 You only get three. No more, okay? Three. All right, y'all. I'll see y'all when I come back. Hold on. You're not holding them good. Come on. I'll see y'all in a bit. So the kids eating lunch now. They eating some of the chicken I cooked last night and some macaroni noodles. That's what they eating right now because they was hungry. And I just been chilling my stomach still hurt i don't know what the world and i feel like i ate something bad mm -mm. but yeah y'all my stomach hurt that's how mom was hurting it's giving a stomach bug go get the track it's giving stomach bug and ain't nobody got time for that Hey y'all, real quick, I'm at Family Dollar. The kids at home sleep with my home girl. She was she stopped by the house and she was just about to leave. And I'm like, oh girl, before you leave, like let me run to Family Dollar real quick. It's 9:30. They close at 10. I have to get a plunger, y'all, because Martin uh clogged up the toilet using paper towels. She said she asked me where the tissue was at, but I couldn't hear her because I was using the drill. So she used paper towels and now the toilet cloth. And she used them good paper towels too, y'all. Bounty. Hold on, I'm looking for my. Hold on, what my oh, that's my cash app card. Yeah, so the toilet cloth. So I'm just running in Family Dollar. I was going to go to Walmart. I even looked up the ad that the plunger is on and everything. But Walmart, it's just like. Baby, I'm just going to get a plunger and some tissue. So I'm just trying to see where it's at. Oh, no, let me get what I said I was going to get. It don't look like they got any plungers. Oh, they got one. Seven dollars? Because it come with this brush, too. I don't need that. I don't feel like going to Walmart. Seven dollars and fifty cent. Yep, the other regular plunger is four dollars. Seven dollars and fifty cent. I don't even need this brush. I'm sad. I'm sad. I guess you can never have too much. Let me get some tissue. I was trying to swipe my car for less than $10. Mm -mm. I need a doormat. Anyways, let me get this tissue. Man, I feel like I need to get some cheap, cheap tissue. How much is this guy? $360. I get this. Oh, candles. Yeah. 
Oh, I need a coat hook. Y'all can't wait till I start decorating. I'm trying to save money, so next month is when I can start splurging on stuff. Decorating things. But let me go. Oh, I need this light. I need this for a new bag. So I don't always have to have a light on with that fan. To open three AA batteries. I wonder, is it like, oh, it's touch activated. I want something that's automatic activated. But anyways, let me get out of here, y'all. All right, so I'm back. My homegirl left. She gotta be to work. I got my $8 plunger. Like $8? But I'm glad it got this thing though. Luckily, it's nothing in the toilet. Cause baby, it would take me way longer than it should to clean it because I throw up at the side of things like that. That's the one thing about me as a mom. I get weak in the knees. Kids still sleep. Okay, y'all. Have a I walk the teacher came. She going to go see. And my teacher. The two fairy really came? Yes. What? I got five dollars. Ooh, my two truck came. Ooh, my two truck came. Five dollars. <laughs>